never said I couldn't wonder A human being, they do this kind of To him fellow human being You're not human being, they do this kind of To him fellow human being Because some kind things were good they have does not hurt. Neither is love wicked. Love is a sweet thing everybody will want to have. In this case, it is Juliet who is wicked and it is Juliet who hurt you, not love. Dad, I spoke to you but you wouldn't listen. You wanted to do what you wanted to do for yourself. What did we get in return? Broken heart for you and a disgrace and embarrassment for the family. In fact, you made me an object of ridicule. I'm sorry, Dad. I'm sorry, I, I didn't mean to to bring this kind of embarrassment upon the family. Anyway, it is well. Everything is okay. I guess you will be fine. As for Juliet and her mother, that don't hurt Juliet and her mother. What do you mean? If you love me, I would be as a good friend to get
Thank God, though. Eh? I was so scared, mommy. I just couldn't stand anything happening to you. Just like I couldn't stand to watch anything happen to my only surviving child. I didn't even know what I could have done. There was no doctor around to save your life. <laughs> nothing would have happened. How do you mean nothing would have happened, Mom? You didn't know the state you were in yesterday. I knew exactly how to Listen. I did what I did yesterday to save your life. See, the way I saw you, I knew that I had to take drastic measures. So I decided to act up. I pretended I was not feeling well. Oh, and my that God. stopped you from taking the poison. Mom, no way! You're kidding me, eh? Mom, you're and kidding that me. that saved your life. No, Mom. Honestly. Mom, you mean nothing happened to you yesterday? No, nothing happened to me. I was perfectly fine. Mom, you pranked me, yeah? I got you there. <laughs> oh my God, Mom, that was so scary. You, you, you almost scared the life out of me. Mom, please don't do that next time, huh? It's yeah. Oh, so both of you are just there. So this is where both of you are. Chatting and laughing at what you did to me, to my son and my family. No, Chief. Isn't it? We're, we're not laughing at you. Shut your mouth, yeah. Shut your mouth before I shut it for you. Sorry, Daddy, I hope all is well. Who is your daddy? Oh, you don't know your daddy. I'm not like that, your daddy that is dead. Stupid! Oh my god! Yes! Don't you ever call me daddy again. If you call me daddy, the thing I will do to you, you will never believe it. Jesus! Call him the thing you have done. You don't know what you have done. Hey! Go inside. Bring out everything inside the house. I don't understand. Watch what, 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 what you bring out. Why are you here? 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 Oh my god, she's out! She doesn't have any money! What's wrong? Why are you doing this to us now? You don't have anywhere to stay with. You don't know who? Yes. How is that my business? Hey. What's that one who brought you to Enugu? Bring out those things out of here! Chief, I beg of you in the name of... Can you just... Please just have mercy on me. Please just shut up! Shut up, you! Shut up! 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 Oh, oh, wait, can you just wait? Can you just wait? Oh my god. Mommy, mommy. Bring everything up. Chief. Chief, please, I beg of you. Chief, please have mercy. Chief. Hey. I said, bring everything out. You get out. Get out. Hey, go back. Make sure you didn't spoil anything that I talk. Hey, hey, sit down, man. Chief, I'm chief. Chief, I'm chief. Chief, I'm chief. I'll be counting. One, two. Chief, if I fall, chief, 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 if I fall, one cow. I'm not even voting. I just stand in there. Chief, I said, leave me. Chief, 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 Matter. What is chasing after you? Johnson, I'm talking to you. Johnson. 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 What is the matter with you? Why are you driving like someone who is being chased by death? In fact, have lost it. What are you talking about? They are nowhere to be found. Who are these people you are talking about? Juliet and her mother. I went there and I couldn't find them. Juliet and her mother. 
just funny that. Why, 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 why are you laughing about this? When a child insists on seeing the depth of his arrows, he will surely hit his head on the ground. I don't get what you're talking about, Dad. When an elderly person sits down and sees something, the child cannot see it, even if he climbs to the topmost part of the mountain. That the more you talk, the more you get me confused with your endless parables. Justin, I knew it. I warned you, but you wouldn't listen. I told you that girl and her mother were nothing but gold diggers. But you wouldn't listen to me. They made away with all the property. Nothing was left. Yes, I knew it. Uh, how did you know? I went there to, to ask her about the drama that happened yesterday. I, I wanted to confront her to know the reason why she put up that kind of attitude. And to my greatest surprise, I couldn't find a pin, let alone a human being. Johnson, and that was why you were dragging like somebody being chased by death? Dad, I'm as good as dead. Haven't you realized I, I love her so much? Shut that your stupid mouth, Johnson. What do you know about love? What do you know? Tell me. What do you know about love? I don't want to hear that stupid statement from you anymore. If I do, I will show you that I am cheap Benson. Ejimonye, your father. Now get inside and go and do something better with your life. Love. I love her. Why do you have to treat me this way? Why bring such humiliation and disgrace upon me? I loved you with all my heart. I was ready to do anything for you. I thought I had found that virtuous woman, that priceless jewel, the mother of my children. But no, I was wrong. My father was right. He warned me, but I wouldn't listen to his wise counsel. And yet I feel like cursing you for what you did to me. Yes, searching for someone to love you. Someone to love you to prove you true. Sandy, Sandra, Sandra, uh, why are you like this now? What's that? Why, why are you like this? She knows that this guy to be up. This is just life for you. You just have to calm down. Okay? Please. So, Sandra. You have to stop this, you're crying and thinking. You don't have to cry over a split oil. I, I mean, it's not gonna help anything here. I'm not crying. I'm just... I'm just surprised. You're just surprised? I, I, are you surprised that Johnson of all people could stoop so low has to go for your low life sister who betrayed you? Juliet. Juliet, my sister is not a low life. And she'll never betray me. Okay? Sandra, your sister is not a low life. So, what did she do to you? I'm asking, what did she do to you? She did everything a young girl could do. Yes, my sister did everything she could do for me and Johnson to be together. Julia did everything she even, oh, she even wanted us to get married. She wanted everything. She, just, she wanted me to be happy. And, 
for it. Well, anyway, you can believe anything you want to believe. We just got a gist. So he said to my toy, what are you friends for? Anyway, let me go and get something to eat. As you can see, maybe Sandra is not in her right mood. I'm coming with Johnson, I've noticed you're not eating for the past one week. No, I didn't know you were around. It's 15 minutes past 11 and you still haven't taken breakfast. What is wrong with you? Nothing, I'm not hungry yet. I'll eat when I'm hungry. Johnson, I don't know what the problem is because you have refused to tell anyone. But whatever the problem is, this attitude of not eating will not work. And he has to stop this minute. Dad, I just told you I will eat when I come to And that reminds me. You've not been going to work for the past one week. I took some days off. I needed to rest. I'll resume work soon. Just let the air be free. Why are you staring at um, Chile's picture and what is it? What is wrong? Cynthia, I have a strong feeling that my sister and her mother are going through hell. How do you mean? I don't know how to explain it. <laughs> you know, you know that we're passing through a whole lot of pain and I just, I just wish I could just see my sister. I just want to see them. Sandra, are you out of your mind? You just wish you can see your sister. When you know they were ostracized and banished from your... I don't care, Cynthia, I don't care! My sister, you understand? I don't care. Just don't care. Sandra, don't care. Even when you know you'll be struck by Tonda, if you have anything to do with them or let alone near them. See, I don't know how to explain this, but I believe I have a strong feeling that they're innocent. My sister and my mom are innocent. Don't you understand? I mean, I just. <laughs> Sandra, Sandra, don't tempt your God. I've just said my own. Don't start what you can't finish. <laughs> Juliet, I will find you. I will go any place. I will do anything for you, okay? Just big sister will save you. I will try, okay? Father, I don't, I don't seem to understand you at all. I don't understand you, Dad. How can you understand me? You can't understand me because you have refused to listen to words of wisdom. You can't understand. Dad, that these people are your blood. Your eldest brother's wife and child. I know. In fact, I strongly believe they are innocent. God. I can't start a fight with the entire community. I can't afford to lose you because of this. Dad, Dad, you told me you put up a fight to make sure they were not banished. And I did. I put up a fight to make sure they were not banished. But the entire community came crashing on me. They turned on me. Look, my dear, we have done our very best. No, Dad. You've done your part and I'll do mine. I will go out there and look for them. Huh? Yes. Sandra. 
You want to put us in trouble? Let me warn you, don't you ever think of going out there to do anything that will destroy this family. Dad, I promise you, I'll be very careful. And nothing will happen to us. Nothing. I will look for my, for my sister and her mother. I promise you. Cynthia, Cynthia, why did you go tell my dad about my intention to look for my cousin's sister, Hannah Mother? Tell me why! I don't stand. God! Cynthia, don't give me that pretentious look, okay? Don't give me that pretense! God, you were the only one aware of my intention. Don't forget! Fine! Tell me why my dad called me home to ask me why I had to embark on such a mission! Cynthia, I was only being concerned. Because of the danger you're about to face as my friend. Danger? Yes. Danger. Cynthia, danger. Tell me, what do you know about this? What? I know the gods of your land will strike you with thunder if you ever have anything to do with that girl or her mother, or let alone meet with them. Ah, yes. I see. Okay. I see. I'm the one that shot myself on my leg. Because I told you about it! Now listen to me, Cynthia. Whatever I decide to do about this issue is none of your business! Okay? Just mind your business! Rubbish! Sandy, Imagine! I'm just concerned. Oh, shut it, my please! Friend. Shut it! I'm just being concerned because you're my friend. What is it? What is wrong with you? Gosh. Ever. Mama, don't you think you need to take a little rest or a little break from all of this that you're doing? I think you overlabor yourself. You, I am not overlabor myself. Besides, it's good exercise. Up, down, up, down. Eh? <laughs> Mama, I'm not complaining. Asha me, Pesa. Mama, you, you always have a way of defending yourself. Eh? But, Mama, you know what? I think I would just want you to take your time out to rest sometimes because I want my mom to always look this young and beautiful for me. Mama, I'll be near. I don't go be sick. I'll tell you. Eh? I will take out time and rest at the right time. Eh? <laughs> I hate you. Oh, no. Uncle no, I think I have to go to work now. Before my madam, Madame Tessie, starts shouting at me. Oh. Mm -hmm. You know how she gets at times with me. Okay, now, madam, yeah, okay. Maybe I should help you. Oh, no, don't worry, bro. I can manage. Have a good day. Mama, you. Mama, you. Mama, you. Mama, you. Exercise is one, two, one, two, one, two. Where have you been? I've been looking for you. I've been around, I've been around. So what's up with you? Mm -mm. Don't lie to me. You've not been around. No one has seen you around since all this while. Tell me, I'm a friend. Where have you been, Sandra? Linda, okay fine, I'll just tell you, I've been in search of my sister and her mother, I've been looking for them. Oh, that's very good, so, so what's about seeing them like? Seriously Linda, I'm just confused, where I went, where they were staying before, no one seems to know about them. I asked around but nothing, no information. 
So what, what are you going to do now? What, what is your plan? Like, what are you trying to do? What is I your plan? I don't know, plan? right? I'm just confused. I don't know what to do. Babe, please, I'm just tired. I just want to go in there and rest. I'm famished. Okay, you know what? Don't, don't, don't just worry yourself, okay? You know, I have the strong belief that very, very soon, this whole problem is going to end, okay? Okay, don't just stress yourself just, out. Babe, I, I, I really pray so. Thank you. No problem. Thank you. I just hope so. So, where is Cynthia? <laughs> Alright, now. Thank you. Right, Thank you. Do you know that I'm getting worried by the day? Worried? Why? Is there a problem? Mom is my madam. Your madam? What happened? I don't know, but I just think that woman hates me. <laughs> I've told you times with that woman. Don't say things like that. Why would she hate you? Nagini Mezi. Mom. I'm an adult and I know when someone shows me love and when someone shows me hate. Mom, that woman doesn't like anything about me. She can even do anything to make me lose my job in that house. This is serious though. Mom, it's very serious. It's very serious though. Things even go worse when her husband is not around. It's you. There's nothing I do that ever pleases her. She picks at me at the slightest mistake, mom. She doesn't spare me. Okay. Do you know that she poured water on me? Eh? Now give me mercy. This woman poured water on me just because I was 15 minutes late for her errands. Only 15 minutes late, oh mom. Ha. All my efforts to explain things to her that there was traffic on the road. She didn't even listen to me. She didn't listen to me at all. That is how bad it is, man. Mom, when did he? Just take the whole thing as part of your training. Eh? Things will definitely improve. And when that happens, all the humiliation will be in the past. Don't worry. It can't be like this forever, you know. Mom. That's if only we'll be alive to see that deal. Shh. Of course we will be alive. Eh? We will be alive. Huh? Mom, well, it's because of the way things are going. Eh? Well, if you say so, I've always told you one thing. When there are problems, you take everything to God in prayers. Now eat your food. The and how come we see? I just, I answered you when I heard you called me, ma. Are you now calling me a liar? No, ma. Are you calling me a liar? This useless thing. Eh? Are you calling me a liar? Eh? Eh? Are you calling me a liar? Why did you have to leave my own this? And the whole time you with me. Eh? Why? I was meant to do it when you asked me to come and wash the car. You yeah, are washing what? You yeah, are washing the car. Yeah, so how long will you take it to wash the car? But please, how long? How, how long will you take it to wash the car? What's going on here? What's going on here? Hmm. Sweetheart. Where did you bring this village champion from? So, what has she done this time? What has she done this time? This thing left my own dish in the water without washing them. Come on, honey. 
But I overheard you telling her to leave whatever she was doing and come wash the car. Yes. The, the, how long does she have to take her to, to wash the car? How long? How long does she have to wash the car, baby? How long? Disappear from my presence. Now! Before I destroy that thing you call a face! Sleeping! <laughs> You have to take it easy with this girl. She's trying her best, but you she not like her at all. Hey! Don't. A human being, they do this kind thing. To him, fellow human being. Shut a human being, they do this kind thing. That was sleeping and left the door open. What is wrong with you? Are you where you're struggling with? Oh my god. Yes, my door was open. Yes, Sandra, you left your door open. And only for us to come in here and see you struggling with something as if you're fighting with someone in the dream. Hey. Oh my god. Oh my god. I would have. Hey, I would have saved her. Hey, hey but. The beast. Oh. Saved her. Oh God. Oh, the beast. Which beast are you talking about? You have saved who? Sandra, you are confusing us. Okay, okay, okay. okay. okay just calm down. Okay. Calm down. Talk to us. As in, what's happening? I had a terrible dream. Yes, girls. I, I saw my cousin, sister, and her mother. Yes, I saw them. They were. Oh God, they were tied in different trees and the beast, yes, I wanted to save them, I wanted to save them but it's like, use the force, I, 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 then, this is serious, this is serious, yes, yes it's serious, yes, it's serious, Sandra, this is not just an ordinary dream, I think we need to do something about this, but we should know what to do, yes, sorry, this is serious, <laughs> They need my help. They need help. I'm sure they're in trouble. Don't you understand? Don't worry. I think I know what to do. Are you serious? Yeah. Cynthia. Oh, Cynthia, thank you. Thank you. Tell me. Okay, Cynthia, please. If you know anything you can do for us to help these people, please, just let us know. Please. I said you girls should not worry. I know what to do. I'll get to the root of this. Don't worry. Please. Cynthia, I can do anything. I don't want to sound good. Don't worry. Don't worry. Don't worry. Don't worry. Don't worry. What is it? It's okay. It's trouble. What? trouble. I saw it in my dream. It's okay. It's okay. So, it has gotten to the level of you, like me, my own younger brother. <laughs> Mother, I, I, I swear to God, I, I swear in God's name, I'm not lying against him. I'm not. God, you, you nothing but a sheep slot. Do you think? I will ever believe this your stupid story. <laughs> My brother in his class. 
condescend so low to your level. You're nothing but a stinking, smelling pig! A girl. Enough, Tessie. Enough. Why call her names? And by the way, we are taking sides already. Why not wait and hear exactly how it happened? Come on, honey. I know my brother too well. He cannot bring himself down to, to this thing. My brother goes for the best. I know him! Julie, talk to me. What exactly happened? Sir, after work yesterday, I wanted to go home, but Madame said I should not go home, I should stay back. She complained of being afraid to stay home alone, so I decided to stay back. She said she was not sure of James coming back, and we were not coming back as well last night. show pity for a fellow woman who has just lost her pride to your brother in this manner don't you have conscience or does her pride as a woman mean nothing to you i'm disappointed in you i really am <laughs> julian just calm down but for the emergency i have now i will have taken you straight away to the hospital but don't worry, as soon as I get back the next hour or so, I'll do that, okay? Just get ready. Inside, 
go. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Stop crying. Stop crying. It's okay. Now get up. Get up. Get up. Let me take it to, to, to the hospital. Oh, Why are you like this? Why have you changed suddenly into a quarrelsome, vicious, hateful woman? I thought I knew you, but no, I don't. <laughs> Meaning what? Meaning that you are no longer the peace-loving woman I married. You now quarrel, nag, over little things. Why is that? So, I'm now in my room. Okay. We are not in my room. So tell me, what has that poor and innocent girl done to you? That she's now your worst enemy. And you see nothing wrong whatsoever in anything she does. She is evil. So evil. I don't want her. Period. I don't. You know I'm wondering who the real evil is here. I'm yet to understand that. If it is not you that has become so quarrelsome, so vicious and violent, or if it is the poor innocent girl in whom I've seen nothing to deserve this maltreatment from you. Tell me, so who is the real evil here? By the way, why did you withhold her salary for last month? Or has your wickedness got to that level? Mm. The... I can see! There is something going on between you mm. and that idiot! To God, I don't get to find out. Because if I do, you know what I can do. Now listen to me, woman. You can think whatever you like. I don't care. But pay attention. Let this be the last time you will ever withhold a salary. Never try it again. And one more thing: never lay a hand on her again. Is that clear? Because if you do. You are going to see the very wrong side of me. I've warned you for the last time. I said it! I said it! There is something cynical going on here! There is something! Ah! They see. Shit. What? Hmm. This fire. This fire that this girl is starting. I will make sure. I was the very first man Juliet brought to this house. And it was my father who drove you out of that place. Mom. Yes. You're the first man that she brought. If Juliet had another man, would I be struggling and slaving my life away, hawking fruits on the streets? just to put food on our table. Besides, if we had really taken those properties, we would have sold them and started a better life for ourselves. 
or you will probably be sitting on a better chair. Not on this plastic chair, don't you? This is not fair. It's so not fair. Life has not been fair to us. Life has not been fair to us. But we've accepted it as God's will. And I can enjoy a bit we cannot fight God. We can't. Something, something has to be done about this. I mean, you, you can't continue like this. You can't continue this way. Please, Johnson. I beg of you in God's name, just, just leave us the way we are. I and my mom, we've been through so much already. We've been through so much pain and humiliation. I don't think we're ready to go through another one. Just leave us the way we are. Please, we're gonna be fine. Please. What must be done? Driving like someone whose house is on fire. I thought I knew you well, Dad. And what's the meaning of that rubbish? Every responsible father does the best for their child. Why is yours different? Why are you bent on killing my joy? Mr. Son, I can't wait for you to rain these allegations against me. What has Juliet done to you? What? What do you want from her? Don't insult me or I'll... Oh, you kill me? You killed me the very day you threw Juliet and her mother out of that house and came back to tell me they ran away with all the property. Why did you do what you did? Are you questioning me? I have every right to. I am beginning to suspect you have got something to do with that lunatic who showed up at the church with some fake marriage certificate. I don't know what you're talking about. Deny it. Deny you did not throw Juliet and her mother out of that house. Deny you did not send your boys to throw your things out of that compound. This is so. I wanted the best for you. That girl, Juliet, is not good enough for you. A girl who will hide the fact that she was already married to somebody and goes ahead to marry you again. She's not good Oh, right. cut it, father, cut it. Juliet has never been married. I was the first man she took to her house. And I will dig. I will dig until I unravel whoever is behind us. And for your sake, I pray it is not you. Johnson! Johnson! What is wrong with this boy? Gillette. This is Engineer Dave, the one I told you I work for. Hi! Nah! No. 
Hey, Engineer Dave. Oh, Mwa. Juliet has told me all you've been doing for her. Oh, really? Madalo. <laughs> and I just want to say thank you. Especially after that accident she had. All the treatment you gave her. I... May the God of the widows and the fatherless bless you. Amen. No, but I can't get him a seat. Let's have one song. Let's have one song. Come on, let me wait. Oh, so, so, so. Eh. Let me have one song. Hi, no, 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 you know, before she called me, I was in the kitchen preparing something. Let me get you some food. Are you sure? Not worry. I am part of this family. I'm not a stranger, so don't don't worry. Oh, oh, God, how is your wife? She's fine, she sends her regards. Can I let me greet her for me? Hello, Biko. Biko, just let me just go back to the kitchen and finish up. Oh, can you not let her go? Juliet, Mama, dear. Hey, Juliet, why did you lie to your mother? Why did you tell her the truth? Why did you say you, you had an accident? Uh, uh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry I lied. Eh? I lied because I don't want my mom to see you and your family as bad people. I know how she can get with things like that. Besides, she would have stopped me from working for you people by now if she knew. And I wouldn't want that all. Because I, I knew how long it took me to get the job. That's why I lied. I'm sorry. I see. So you were actually trying to save the face of the woman that almost killed you if I hadn't come to your rescue at the time I did. Eh, but God brought you at the right time now to save me. Eh? That was why you came. It wasn't even up to the one hour you said you were going to spend outside. And eh? you saved me. I think you're right. You're right because I didn't even get to where I intended to go. Something just told me to turn and go back to the house. And I'm glad I listened to that voice. Thank you, sir. Uh, so why didn't you tell me you had accommodation issues? Yeah. I don't like this place at all. I don't like the environment. But, sir, the truth is that since there is nothing we can do about it, you have to like it. You have to accept it the way it is and like it. Huh? Not anymore. I will not forgive myself if I fail to do anything about it. I don't like this place and I, 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 I'll definitely do something about it. Thank you, sir. <laughs> Thank you very much, sir. You have to look Thank for you, something sir. better. Thank you, sir. God bless you. Excuse me, sir. Mama. Mama is coming. Okay. Oga, um, Mama says she'll ask you if you eat something. I don't know. I'm not too worried. I already told you I'm okay. I don't want to eat it. Hi. Welcome, Oga. <laughs> Welcome, sir. Amen. <Yeah. laughs> I don't seem to understand. Honestly, what do we do from this point now? I don't know what to do. Now this is the third time I'm seeing them in my dream. And, and that beast, that beast is always after them. Hmm. The question is, what does the beast want from them? Dad, I really wish I had an answer to that question. I'm just confused. Hmm. Okay. If it is true that it, there is a beast after them, then it probably means that the gods are actually not happy with them. It also means that one of them has a hand in my brother's death. Dad? Oh my 
Uncle, father, I'm disappointed at your thought. No, I believe they're innocent. Yes, I'm just, I'm just worried. I know I have this feeling, I have this feeling that they're in trouble. Something is wrong somewhere. They're innocent. I believe they are innocent too, but what can we possibly do now? No one knows where to find them or where they are in the first place. And I've been to places where they might be, but there are no traces of them. Maybe they're not alive. Oh my God, Father Jesus, God forbid! God forbid, God forbid. Father, oh, please, I, I know, I know you can do this. But I know you're a great man, Dad. I want you to help. I want you to help me look for them. Please, Dad. Please, I beg you. Okay. Well. For your sake, I will do everything possible to ensure that they are found. Oh my god, thank you, Dad. Thank you. Oh my god. Oh, Dad. To the best, Dad. Thank you so much. They will be found. I know. Mama? Juliet? Juliet? Is anyone home? You've been searching for true love. Mama! Seeking for someone to love you. Someone to understand. Someone to carry. Mama! Mama! Juliet! Sorry, sir. Good morning. Good morning, thank you. Um, do you know where the occupants of this building are? And did you let and the mother? Exactly. Do you know where they have gone? Uh, uh, I don't know, but I saw them parking their properties in the vehicle two days ago. But I worry about now is not what I'm too sure of. Um, but parking their properties, are you are you suggesting they have moved? I don't know. Yes. Where to? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Yes. Uh, do you have any foreign address or anything I can look at them with? so arrogant that you have no respect for your father anymore my arrogance started the very day you decided to stand between me and my happiness you are not my father so don't even see yourself as such Johnson what is all this madness why why did you throw them out why did you have to go push them out of the little place they found refuge why What do you mean? And who are these people you are talking about? I give you 48 hours to bring back and find the others from my mom. Else, you will see the other side of me. I will do something so drastic, any ear that hears it will tingle. Mark my word, father. Johnson! Thank you. 
Papa. You're welcome, my children. You have come to seek the way about of your cousin and her widowed mother. No pain is hidden from the eyes of the gods. Before them, we are all naked. Please, Baba, do anything within your powers to help us find them. Please, it, it, it's making my friend have sleepless nights. Please, Baba. What is after them is a very, very strong spirit. Who wants them to suffer? So finally, die. Sir, um, um, who, who, where, where is the spirit? And where is my cousin and her sister? Who is the spirit? Who? The identity of the spirit and the whereabouts of your sister and her mother was not revealed. But a sacrifice will be performed to identify the spirit. After that, I will be able to stop the spirit from coming. Okay, and um, Papa, like, what items are, are needed? A black goat, seven cola nuts, gunpowder, and a bottle of hot drink. Okay, Baba, no problem. We'll get back today. That will be between 24 hours. No problem, Baba. We'll come back before that. Thank you, sir. Tabo, 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 I have seen you and have raised you all these years since the demise of his mother. Although these past years I've tried to make you happy as a father, where did I go wrong? You have just 24 hours to provide them or I won't be responsible for my actions. I saw why so much hatred. You now talk to me as if I'm your worst enemy. You used to be my best friend. What happened? Why all this? Give me one reason why I should trust you. Because I'm your father. I'm your only surviving parent. I won't deceive you. Believe me, son. I don't know anything about their present location. Yes, I threw them out and that's because I thought what happened on that wedding day was true. And that those people are suffering. They need help, our help. Just tell me what you want me to do for you and I promise I will do it. I want them found and I want a better life for them. Consider it done, son. Consider it done. Just be happy for me. Happiness comes when one is fulfilled. Right now I am empty and deserted. I want Juliet and her mother found and given a better life. That's when I'll be happy. Sandra, what's up? Are you still in school today? No, you're not in my show. I woke up late. Okay, that's right. So what's up now? The movement is until the best day. The Gobalao. Papa Lao, you said? Yes, so. Girl. Yes, so I was surprised and scared like you at first. <sighs> Babe, guess what? The man said that what is chasing them is an evil spirit. And the evil spirit will not even rest until they die. <gasps> so. 
don't know. He asked us to go that we need to get um, some some things for sacrifice. After we should tell us what to do next. So what's about you guys got on it? Yes, so we got it that same day, but he asked us to come tomorrow. Hmm. In that case, I may follow you guys. Are you serious? Are you serious? Like, seriously? <sighs> no problem now, because me, I need to find my sister. Daughters of two, keep your greetings to yourself before I seal your mouth. We offended you. We are sorry. We don't know what's going on. Please help us. Who sent you to come and destroy me? Why do you seek the downfall of my shrine? Please, Baba, can you please speak to us in language you understand? You are not. You are very angry. Please calm down, sir. Calm down. And watch you destroy me? No! It will not work! It will not work! But, but, but what is the problem? What, what did we do? I don't have the permission to discuss with you on this matter any longer. Your last visit almost cost me my life. I was warned not to engage in the sacrifice. But I refuse to heed to that warning, and that almost cost me my life. The forces that was with the beast that you saw in your dream almost strangled me. Jesus Christ! Sorry, Baba. Sorry. Baba, you can you can still do something for us. I don't have the permission to discuss with you on this. You don't live here in this moment! I can't believe it. This place is just heavenly. Yeah? Hey! Eba Amaka Palo! Eba TV. Eh? Hi! Hey. Nah. Take your snake in me. How do we thank you? Eh? My daughter and I are very grateful. We will forever be indebted to you. Darling. Thank you very much, sir. Thank you very much. God bless you for reaching out to us in this manner. Thank you. Well, I'm happy. I'm indeed happy that I've been able to put those smiles on your beautiful faces once more. And um, trust me, I'll be there for you anytime, any day. It's a promise. You can count on that. Nah, darling. Thank you. You're welcome. I am particularly happy that you, you like the place. <laughs> I don't like the place, so. <laughs> we love it! We love the place! <laughs> <laughs> hey! I'm not feeling the name, Ah, that's good to hear. Really good to hear. And, uh, Juliet. Sir. I don't want you to continue working for me and my wife as a household. You know why? You are going back to school. Eh? Yeah. Hey! Nah, you, you, you've done so much already. Nah, I'm not complaining. I'm not. Besides, such a brilliant girl, she will not be allowed to waste like that. We need to encourage her to attain the very top. You know, that she desires. And that's exactly what I intend to do. 
very much, sir. Thank you. Bless you, please, sir. Please, thank you very please, much. No, no, just, no thank just you just very much, sir. Thank you. So, if I'm going back to school, mom, yeah. but, but sir, you've already done so much. Uh, you don't have to. You, you, I'm you, not complaining. Really, mom, yes, let's, let's go and get him something to eat. No, 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 Okay. I guess I have no choice if you insist. I must you must have it will make us happy. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. My brothers, things are not only bad, it is getting worse. I am not comfortable. I'm not finding it funny again. The least I have to say is I am scared. I'm no longer comfortable the way things are going on right now in this community. Our Igwe, the king, who is supposed to be at the forefront of this fight, is not yet back from his so-called checkup abroad. Oh. Diokura himself, he says that this is just the beginning. What we are seeing is the tip of the iceberg. That very soon, worse things are coming upon us like a deluge. What can be worse? than what we are going through now. What can be worse than our river suddenly going dry? Or oh, what can be worse than rain not falling for several months and we are suffering? Hmm. My people. Are you sure the ego has not gotten the information and decided to stay over there till all these calamities are over? Oh. Uba, you have a point there. Otherwise, there is no reason for an Igwe to abandon his community at a period of crisis like this. The question now is, what do we do? How do we salvage this bad situation? We will wait now. We will wait. Okurawa says he's still going on with the sacrifices. So we will wait until he finishes so that we can see what change will come. If it will come. <laughs> that reminds me. I have not even paid the 5,000 naira levy for the sacrifice. Mazuba, what are you talking about? I you not the one who opened this your mouth to say that there's only four days to the sacrifices, yet you have not paid? Mazike, things are really hard. You yourself, you know I am not as rich as you are. Well, you have a point. You have a point because I am beginning to be worried now on that. Within the last three months, we have sacrificed 15 cows. Yet, nothing has not changed. Shit. Absolutely nothing. Okay. We are still suffering. We are still talking. Now, what are we going to do? But nevertheless, I will run along to make sure I pay before it's late. If you don't pay now, they will say that you are contributing to the problem. <laughs> I think I will better go with you so that we will do something about it at once. Okay, I thank right. you people for coming. I still don't understand why Baba had to chase us the last time. Mm. It was very, very confusing and embarrassing. As it stands now, I think Baba is the only hope we have now. Yes. So what I'm saying? That they won't be found or what? I didn't see that. See? Look, the way things are, I think Baba is the only one we have right now to help us find them. Yes. Girl, Sandra, what's up? You're not talking. Are you not here? Sandra, what is it? What do you want me to say? See, I have nothing to say. I'm just confused. Girls, I wish I knew what to do. I'm just tired. No, okay, okay, girls. You know, I'll just go for a prophet or a pastor or something. Please stop it. Just go for a prophet, pastor. The one that will pray from now to 100 years to come and still nothing will happen. See, pastors, they dealt with me, so I don't trust them anymore. Yes. Babes, please, um, it's okay. Right now, I don't think I want to go 
to any pastor or native doctor. I think all I will just do now is go to the police. Give them my sister a picture and a mother. They can help me look for her or something. Babe, see, all these things. God, I can't, just, I can't allow my uncle's family name to just wipe off just like that. No, no, it's not possible. I need to do something. I need to look for them. Tundra, police is not going to do anything with this. You and I know that the spirit behind this is a very strong spirit. So, we don't need police here. No girls. We really just, we just need to sleep about this issue, you know. So by the time we wake up, they've got something to me. Are you not getting it? I'm still saying and I'll continue saying because I know Baba is the only hope we have right now. Yes. <sighs> Hi girls. Honestly speaking, you guys are looking. Are you stupid? Are you stupid? Wait, wait. Do we look like all those your chewing gum girls? Don't you have class? Don't you? Hey, hey, calm down. I didn't mean to disrespect you girls. <laughs> Babes, let's go. No, no, no. Please, let's go. Sweetie, can I also leave you? Oh my god. <laughs> I know I am not much of a church goer. I know I don't know much of the Bible. But I know you said that we should call upon you in times of trouble. And you will answer us. The other day in this church, on this same pulpit, the pastor read from the book of Matthew 7 verse 7 where you say that we should ask and it shall be granted unto us. And we should seek and we shall find. And we should knock and you shall open the door for us. Lord, I have come before you today to ask, to seek and to knock and I know you have no intention of turning your back on me. But if by any chance you intend not to answer my prayers, I have news for you. I will never rest. You know what that means? You will never rest as well. I will keep disturbing you until you grant me my heart desire. Father, Lord, please don't turn your back on me. Father, please help me find my sweet, loving Juliet and her mother. This I ask you in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Prostitute, <laughs> tell this thing to leave my husband alone. Tell her to leave my husband alone. As for you, you think your charm is working, right? Abby, madam, is not what you think. Is working. It's not what you think, oh. Shh. If you don't leave him alone, alive, you will leave him in death. Chukwaju. Go for beat. I'll run one camera. Madam, it's not what you. Hey! 
By the time I come back to this house, and I meet you two vultures here, vultures, you will know why I am called Tessie Baby. You call me nonsense. You use the Tessie Baby, you are the one that is the vulture. Without outfit, you are wearing in there, come and get like a vulture. Here and now, get here, here. Baby, I'm not born with vulture. We get now, we are now. And you, what do you have to do with her husband? Eh? Why are you believing her now? Why are you believing her now? Why are you? You want to do that way? Juju, you want to do what? Juju, Juju, Neju, Neju, Neju. I'm not going to do that. I'm not going to do that. Neju, you see him? In a chutty moment. been a good girl. I know we've gone through situations that could change a good girl from being good to bad. But you've remained that good child that I bore. Mm. Why are you saying all of this? That woman's name is Tessie. Mm -hmm. And she's my madam. She happens to be Engineer Dave's wife. Jesus Christ! Don't tell me you're having an affair with, with your boss's husband just so you can change our situation. Mom? How can you say a thing like that? You know that's not true. Mom, I don't have any form of relationship with my boss. Engineer Dave is a very nice man, and you know it. Besides, he's never even said anything as regards me having an affair with him. So that woman came here to accuse you wrongly? Mom, Mom. I thought I've told you severally that that woman doesn't like me. She doesn't like me one bit. Why? Okay. Mom, what if I now tell you that all those injuries I had on my body and I told you I had an accident that she actually beat me up? What? She beat you up? You know I can't tell you such. Besides, I know how you can get with issues like that. Even Engineer Dave wanted telling you I had to practically beg him not to. Because I don't want you to have any problem with anybody. We need to move out of this place. Mom? Why? This place? You mean leave everything? 
But mom, she wasn't the one that gave us this house, you know. She obviously belongs to her husband. That woman spells trouble. It's okay. Go back to sleep. We'll talk about it tomorrow. We'll talk about it tomorrow. I'm going to leave. Okay, so you heard what the man said, right? Dad, is there no other person that can help us? I don't trust that man. I don't. You don't trust Okute. Okute is the strongest herbalist in the whole of this East. As a matter of fact, other herbalists, including even pastors, come to him for powers. If he tells you this is true, it remains true. About the, the evil spirit that's always disturbing them. Are we going to allow the beast to kill them? Huh? And does it mean my uncle's lineage will just go down just like that? It'll just end? My dear, I am worried stiff myself. I wish there was something serious I could do to change all of this. It's given me sleepless nights too. I don't know what to do. Really, Dad, I feel we've not done anything right to savage the situation. Are you telling me that I have not done much? to salvage this situation? Are you saying that I have not done enough? Okay. Maybe you have other ideas to share with me. Just share it and I will do. Tell me what I think. Tell me what you think I should do. Then I will do it. That's the point that I, I, I wish I knew. I don't know. Oh, you don't know. If you don't know, let's go home. Okay, mom. Oh, 
Last time I saw them was in Port Harcourt. Port Harcourt? Oh my god. What? what are they doing in Port Harcourt? I don't know. It beats me. I ran into them somewhere and then I went back there to see if I could relocate them. On getting there, I met a small boy who told me they had moved. And ever since then, I've not set my eyes on them. Do you know I've been searching for them? I even went to Onicha. But I didn't see them. Oh my god. That means I have to start looking for them in Port Harcourt now. Maybe you should. Okay, okay, no problem. I will, I will. You're welcome. I'll be on my way. Alright. Thank you. Thank you. When you see love, when you see love, you fit to recognize it. I don't know you When you see love, when you see love, you fit to recognize it. Cause true love is everywhere. Stop what you're doing. Go and pack your things. We need to leave this place now. People, our lives are in danger. Mom, how do you mean? Hey, eh? Someone told me that Tessie was here yesterday. Madam Tessie came with police men to arrest us. Besides, I saw some people patrolling the compound. We need to get out of here. Huh? Mom, where do we go from here then? Where? How do you want? How would I know? Eh? How do you want to It is better we live here alive than dead. If we die here, nobody will know. I'm not going to get out But mom, Oga Dave is not back from his trip now. Yeah, Oga Dave, eh? Okay, I'm going to go. Wait for Oga Dave. Check your call, Mata. But if you're the child that I gave birth to, you will follow me and get out of this place. Chai! Ah, mom, mom, what is it? Wait, wait. Mom, open your eye. Open your eye. Mom, I can't. Ah, oh, he's back. Wait. Mom, look at that water, water. Chai! Ah, oh. Listen, this is not a matter of crime. Okay? This is not a matter of crime. I just have to be honest with you. You have to act fast. To enable us to run this surgery. Doctor, please, I beg of you. I beg you in God's name. Help my mother. We don't have this kind of money anywhere. Doctor, please have mercy. I have tried for you. I've tried for you, okay? And that is why I reduced this money. What, what do you expect of me to do? To run the surgery without any money? No, 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 no. Doctor, that's what I'm saying. Doctor, see, here's my money. Eh? Doctor, I have 35,000 naira here with me. I beg you, why not, why not start with this first and then I'll, I'll go and look for the other parts? 
This is all I have here. Don't do it. It's very bad. I beg of you, don't do it. Don't leave this. Just, help just listen. Help my mom. We don't run a charity organization here. Please. Why not go get the one fifty thousand? Then we start. Then you go get the remaining two hundred thousand. Is that not fair enough? Doctor, you don't understand. My mom is all I've got. She's the only one left in this world. She's my everything. She's my backbone. Please don't let this happen to her. I beg you in God's name. Doctor, please. Listen, young lady. Listen, young lady. Just listen up. Listen. You see, I've done what I'm supposed to do for you, okay? It's now left for you to know what to do. If your mother loses her sight, of course you know whom to blame. No, 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 I need to go and check no, 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 Get to us. We are back again on the street with with nothing. Where do I even go from here? Who would help me save my mom? Who? Waka <laughs> Dave is not back from his trip yet. I can't even reach him on phone. Johnson. Hmm. Well, how can I? How can I reach him when I don't even have his number? Huh. That doesn't sound like a good idea. That doesn't sound like a good idea at all. Because his father will not spare me if he sees me around his house. So. Oh, come on, Juliet. Juliet, 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 Juliet. Just. Julia, try. Huh? Yes. Yes. There's no harm in trial. That is all I 
Oga, Oga, that Juliet too. Which Juliet? That one who is still making me the coin here again. Oga, she don't run come out. Not yet. Come on, come on, come on, get out of here. Hmm. This is what you and your mother have been going through. Make you just show up to see a show. Uncle, we have really suffered. Me and my mom, we've been through a lot. Uncle, I just, I beg of you, just do all you can to help save my mother. Well, that's not a problem. Hmm? Uh, meanwhile, you will stay here tonight. Hmm? But you will wake up very early in the morning and leave to avoid all of these people from seeing me. I'm sure none of them saw you coming. When you leave here, you will go to the bank where I will meet you and then we will go and see your mother. Thank you so much. Bless you. Yeah, it's okay. It's okay. I, I have decided to damn all the consequences of Keeping you with me, no matter what. Besides, Sandra has been so worried. I'm sure she'll be very happy to hear that you're alive. We've been instructed to bring this useless girl here and to put her to death. Yes. Yes. So let's complete the mission at this point. Yes. Oh, you have it? Better. Wait, wait, wait. Wait, wait. Did you hear the sound? Yes, yes. I heard it too. It sounds strange. It's true. I can hear it too. We must throw this girl to death and get out of here. Mm -hmm. I'm afraid of What if it's to solve it? What do we tell the others? We must accomplish our mission! I'm out! No, wait, wait, wait. Oh, do you think we can do it? Do you think we can do it? Like no, I think we are right. Yes, you are right. Let's go! 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 Let's go!
This is no time to cry. Let's let just, hey! just get me to the scene. I have to speak up, please. Hey! Sandra! Hey, Sandra! You... Oh, Jesus! Why? 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 This is barbaric. They have to pay for this. Calm down, son. There's absolutely nothing you can do about it. How do you mean? It's their tradition. There is nothing you or I can do now that will bring her back to life. Hmm? So, seeing her dead body alone, would have told you that. I didn't see her dead body, Dad. Before we could get to the scene where she was turned to death, her body was no longer there. What? This is serious. So who took her body? I wish I knew. I, I, I wish I saw her one last time. At least to tell her how much I loved her. Those people are heartless. They're wicked. My son, be a man. No amount of tears you shed now that will bring Juliet back again to life. We failed Juliet. We were supposed to be there for her and her mother, but we were not. Take it easy, son. Take it easy. It wasn't your own fault anyway. The gods know the better. It's not your fault. <laughs> Papa, Juliet, how are you today? I'm fine, Papa. It's, where are you going? Papa, I want to go home. Are you sure you are fine enough to get alone? Ah, Papa, I'm very okay to go home. Oh. I'm very okay. Okay. If you say so. But besides, what did you do to them that they want to kill you? Ah, Papa. I have taken my time to explain everything to you. But you seem not to really believe my story. What reason do I have to lie to a man like you? Eh? The only thing I owe you at least is the truth. A man who saved my life. Even when my own people left me for dead. Eh? The least I owe you is the truth. And all I told you is the truth. I'm not hiding anything from you. Eh? I'm not. Hmm. I don't believe that such a thing will happen in this century. <laughs> well, but it actually happened. Um, Papa, I need to go home to my mom. I need to go because my mom really needs me at this point in her life. Okay, no problem. But it can be now. Papa, I'm strong enough. I, I, I'm strong enough to go. Eh, I'm leaving here today, promising you that I will take good care of myself. Eh, I, I'm strong now. Papa, I'm very strong now. If you insist, I will give, I, I will give you my support. Thank you, Papa. Eh? I regret I don't have money to give you to help you your mother's son. Okay, well. But please. One day job. Hmm? Chai. Papa, God bless you. Thank you very much. This God, this God you see, eh? This God will bless you for me. Eh, and I promise I will never forget you in life. In my life, I will never forget you. May God bless you for me. The good Lord we serve will protect you. Yeah. <laughs> Remember to be prayer. That is what you need. Bye. Bye. Careful. All right.
pretext of going to get money for her mother's surgery. Yet no one has seen or heard from her. So this is exactly how they would have run away with my money if I have run the operation without collecting my money. The worst part of it is that you don't have her contacts and her mother keeps crying saying that she doesn't know the whereabouts of her daughter. If not, she would have come to see her without abandoning her here. That's her business. She cannot be occupying her world, cannot be keeping her here, feeding her without getting any money from her. We don't run a charity home here. So you go to her ward and make sure she leaves the place. But sir, I don't think she has a place to go to. I heard her saying that they were sent out of where they were without anything. And considering her blind state, I don't think it's very good to send her away right now, sir. But we'll take care of her bill. What if the daughter doesn't come back? Or come back to say that she didn't get any money? That's the problem. You can go. Thank you, sir. All right. You said you are the God of justice. You said you are the God of the innocent. You said you bring justice to the innocent. Why did you let this happen? Why did you let them kill her? Why did you let this happen to a poor innocent girl? Why did you pretend like you didn't hear my prayers? Why? Why did you let my prayers go in vain? Why did you make me look so stupid and fitness? God bless you! Why come to your God with such a heavy man? Why speak like one without faith? I have faith. That's the thing. But he failed me. God never failed those who trust and serve him. God has not failed you. Then why, why did he let them kill her? Why did he let them not be like innocent? Nothing is hidden before him. Why did he make me see her before them? Why? My brother. Nothing is hidden before our God. He knows before anything happens. You see, God allows whatever thing that happened to happen for a reason. And that reason must be to the glory of God. But I speak no further. Unless you want to attract the wrath of God to yourself. Come, let me show you something in the Bible. Come. Just come with me. what we have been passing through since you traveled. The people are no longer happy with this cabinet. Mm. Igwe, all of us seated here, we have done everything possible to ensure that this calamity stops. But the more we do things, the more it looks like we are not even doing anything. Mm. Well, did you people try consulting other seers from the other kingdoms? Igwe, we did. Even the almighty Echi Dime, but nothing seems to be right. Everything will be right when justice reigns. Ukurara, 
please talk to us. What is the meaning of all these calamities that have been happening in my kingdom? The liberation of this kingdom is with Juliet. Juliet, which, which Juliet? Huh? The one. This particular council banished alongside her innocent widowed mother. I said it. Said what, Okaf? I told you people to leave my brother's wife and only daughter out of this problem because the offense was committed by my brother. But you people will not listen to me. Now here we are now. Quiet, go careful. Okulara, please, how can we locate this Juliet? Uh, she was stoned to death. She was stoned because she violated the laws of banishment. She was seen in the village. So you all think? Or you thought she was dead? Okulara, we don't think. We know. All of us here knew she was turned to death by the youths. What is happening here? Who do I believe? Yeah? She lives. Yeah? She lives. Lives. Juliet. Gatubulato. Yes. She lives. All and Mary, the princess of the realm, is still alive. And she must be found and brought back to this kingdom. Upon her return, she will be crowned the princess of the reign. Okulara, even if she is alive, she did not pass the purification process and test, which others who failed passed through. If she does not take her proper position in this kingdom, this kingdom will face worse situation than she's facing right now. Hi! Okulara. Where do we locate Juliet? This cabinet banished her and her mother for what they knew nothing about. The same cabinet must provide her. And this must be done before the next AK market. Failing to do this, the kingdom will witness the worst situation from the gods. You must bring her home with her mother. And this cabinet must beg them for forgiveness before she will be crowned. That is the message from the gods. That is the message from the gods. Even my brother, I told you, I need to make a lot of money after I have a really big one. Okay, so what I go? No, 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 no. I want to win a book Okay, for Igwe. Any clue where we can locate Juliet? Igwe, with utmost due respect, I have absolutely nothing to do with this particular event because I was not part of the team that decided that my only brother's daughter and wife should be banished from this kingdom. So let those who banished my brother's wife and daughter go back and bring them. That is it. Okafo, why are you talking like this? Talking like somebody whose mouth is studded with stones. Can you we are talking of how to stop war, and you are here telling us something else. Eh? Solution. Can you hold me quiz? Can you imagine? Keep quiet! Why are you like this, Okafo? Keep quiet! You, you talk like someone whose tongue has been twisted by the gods. If you see Okafo, you can't tell me. Leave my brother's wife alone. Quiet! Quiet! Igwe. Sorry for yourself. Let me tell you people, all of us are in this business together and we have to come out of it together. Any one of you who tries to back out, we have need to contend with. You My dear, 
The Lord said I should tell you not to worry again. Your tears are over. Amen. Just have faith in God. You see, God allowed what happened to happen because He wants to draw you closer to Himself. He wants you to be very close to Him. Hmm? It is well. Thank you, Pastor. Thank you very much. You have been of immense help to me and I truly appreciate it. It is well. It is well. Um, I am actually on my way to the hospital. Could you please give me a lift so I can pick a car on the No, I... I would actually take you to the hospital. Anything? Sorry. You have a relative at the hospital? No, really. I knocked down a lady some days ago and she was hospitalized. So I want to go and see how she's doing today. Jesus. Pastor, I... I hope it's not so serious. No, 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 no. no. God is in total control. God is on his throne. God is in control. So, let's... How are you today? Johnson. Juliet? Do you two know each other? Pastor, this is the exact person I was telling you about. Juliet. But I thought you said she's dead. That was what I was told. Oh God. Thank you, Jesus Christ. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Juliet, you were like? Yes. What happened? It's a very long story. It's a long story, but I know I'm saying so well. Thank you, Jesus. 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 Thank you, Lord. I thought I'd lost you. Thank you, God. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank God for me. Thank you. Thank you, Jesus. My dear. Oh, can you want some of them? I failed her. Failed I failed her. I failed my mom. I was supposed to be there for her. Don't blame yourself for your mother's blindness. God knows why it happened. No. I don't care about that anymore. I just, just feel like putting an end to all of this. It's too much of it. No one has the right to do the work of God. It is not the will of God for you to kill yourself. But, if it is the will of God that your mom regains her sight, she will after the operation in London. London? What operation are you talking about? Johnson is making arrangements to fly her after a final operation. <sighs> Who are you talking about? Uh, I'm talking about Johnson. He has actually been disturbing me about the whole marriage issue again. And he even proposed to me yesterday. And what did you say? Please just take me to her, please. I want to see her. From your condition, Sandra. Which is? Listen, I know things have been pretty awkward between you and I lately. I know <laughs> we've not had the best of times. But I beg you with everything you hold sacred. I beg you in the name of God. Help me convince Juliet to marry me. 
I, I love her so much. I, I love her with everything that makes me. I, I, I know she refused to marry me because of my father, but when I look at her, deep, deep down, she loves me. Please, will you? Fine. I will. Just, just take me to her. I want to see her. Look at this small young girl. I am blind today because of them. If they had allowed her, if they had allowed her, I would have had the operation because your father was ready to pray for it. But no, please, 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 please. Just forgive them. I not for anything for the sake of the innocent ones that are losing their lives. And, and the ones that are already losing their lives like my father. Eh? Oh, Kato. Okay, you better. Sandra, what happened to Uncle Kato? <laughs> What is wrong with your father? Mother uh, is dead. You get me to see my father. You can even look at him. I had, I had, my head said when people died in the streets of two days. I'm only going to know what will happen next if you guys don't call. Hey, my brother. Nothing will happen to a car for my brother, my husband's brother. You know, we will go. We will go. Stop crying. Yes. Your father is a nice man. We will go. We will go with you. Ebezina! 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 It's okay. We will go for his sake. We will go. Stop crying. When you come for is a nice man. I will go with you. If I go now, Major. Major, I will go. I will go. Sandra, if we would go like, like my mom just said, but we're going there just because of the sake of your father, my uncle, and for the sake of other innocent people that, that may lose their life, we don't go. We're not going because of Ulamiri. Is it Mama going to bless you, Juliet? Mama going to bless you. Oh, my God. So, Mama, Mama, thank you. It's okay, it's okay, Abessina. Where are we going? Where are we going, Mama? Maybe tomorrow. We go tomorrow, yes. But we have to wait for Pastor Ken to come back. He has to go with us. We need to discuss with him. Okay, Sanjee. Oh, my God. We have to discuss it with him. Oh, God. 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 Johnson, I will not allow my only child marry a cripple when there are many girls out there looking for husbands to marry. Johnson, why do you want to drag the name of this family in the mud? You are the one who has vowed not to see your only son happy. Don't talk to me in such a despicable manner. Do we not? Nobody in our lineage has ever married a cripple or anybody with any form of disability. So you will not, do not start from me. You are my son. I will not write history. At least not when I'm alive. Juliet was not born a cripple. 
It was an accident. Moreover, if you hadn't thrown she and her mother out of that house, this would not have happened. Why are you making things so complicated and difficult? Can, can't you see I love her? Can't you see how, how happy I have become since I found her again? Oh, Jesse, I weep for you. I can see the spell that girl and her mother cast on you. It's working. But I assure you, I know a very strong man who can destroy it. Oh, yes. I will make sure I bring you back to your senses. If I don't get married to Juliet, then kiss every dream of carrying your grandchildren goodbye. Because I'm going to remain single forever. Suit yourself. I'm not moved by your threat. I'm not threatening you. It's a fact. I heard all of that happened to you and your daughter in this community when I was not around. But I want to let you people know that I did not know anything about the world. However, let me tell you people that your banishment from this kingdom has caused a lot of problems. And as revealed by Ukloa, the liberation of this kingdom will come with the return of you and your daughter. Yeah. We are sorry, please forgive and forget. Oh, we, are very sorry. Sorry. we are sincerely sorry. Please, please, sorry. please, we are sorry. For all the ill treatment, please, sorry. please forgive us. My fathers. Eh, what can we say? We forgive. Igwe, you're a good man. You're a decent man. God will bless you. Isse. Chukuga Agosi, it shall be well with you. Isse. Alice, our wife, we are deeply sorry for everything. Igwe, let us send message across to Kulora. So for us to start the cleansing, many people have lost their lives and many at the point of death. Let us be fasting whatsoever we are about to do. So to save their lives, especially that of Okafo. Okafo? You mean Uncle Okafo? Yes. No, dear. How? Ah, Igwe, what can we do to save his life? I do not want to lose my uncle. We shall go straight to the shrine for the sacrifice to be carried out. And after that, we shall go to the shrine of all Amiri for you to be crowned the princess of the rain. Eh? Hey, Mbani. Me? Mbani, Igwenu. Iku Fegon. Princess of all Amiri. Yes. Igwe. My fathers, eh, please, I'm very sorry. Uh, we only came here so that we can help to save lives. We do not come to partake in any ritual or coronation into Olamiri. Or, uh, we don't understand what you're talking about. We cannot be part of it, Igwe. My I'm daughter. sorry. My daughter, what do you mean by that? My fathers, Igwe, we are Christians. We do not believe in idol worship. So we, we cannot partake in any form of sacrifice that we know nothing about. I'm sorry. My daughter, that is the only way out. Mbamba Igwe, that is not the only way out. Jesus is the only way out of any situation. We, we, we came here with a man of God, a powerful one. Pastor, come on, baby, 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 and this particular person is the reason for all that has been happening in this community. Igwe, 
Igwe, God saved your life because of a good heart. If not for the grace of God upon your life, Igwe, you would have been dead. Hey! And your throne taken from you. Thank you, Jesus. What are you talking about? Hey! <laughs> Thank God! Lives will be restored today in the name of Jesus! Amen! Amen. Lives will be restored today in the name of Jesus! Amen! Maluya Riba Rebu! Ay, 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 yeah. Mm. Yeah. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Hey, yeah. hey, yeah. hey. There is power mighty in the blood. There is power mighty in the blood. There is power mighty in the blood of Jesus Christ. There is power mighty. In the oh, in the blood, there is power mighty. Oh, in the blood, there is power mighty. In the blood, there is power mighty. In the blood of Jesus Christ, there is power mighty. In the oh, in the blood. King of glory, but let the Holy Ghost come down. Let the power of all of you this place. Lord Jesus, have your way. King of glory, come down in your power. Thank you, Jesus. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. In the name of Jesus Christ. In the name of Jesus Christ. Father, Lord, we thank you for today. Bless that be your holy name. Lord, let your glory come down. Lord, let your anointing come down. Holy Spirit, have your way. No, 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 Fire, fire all over my body. I will confess. I will confess. Please speak. Please help me. I will confess. I'm be free from I your sins. Speak. I will speak. I will speak. Don't kill me. I am a bad man. I am a bad man. I did it. I did it, Igwe. Help me, Igwe, please. Igwe, I did it. I did it. I am the one who. I am the one who did it. Chief Okafo. Our people say that when you thank a man for whatever good thing that man did for you, that he will end up doing even more next time. Now that is a very wise saying. And you talk like a wise woman. Thank you, Nai. But um, I don't seem to understand where all of that is coming from. Um, actually, Nai, we came to thank you for begging and convincing the Igwe to forgive us the idea we fought at the palace. Mm. As maid is in the palace, we may not have anything to offer to you for what you've done for us. But may the gods bless you for us. And may people never cease to speak for you whenever it is necessary. Take the way you talk quietly when you were the one fighting. <laughs> Anyway, um, we will thank the gods for making the Igwe listen to me and for allowing the Igwe to forgive you because what you guys did was very, very, very bad and I pray it will not happen again, okay? Yes, we are very grateful, Nani. We promise it won't repeat itself again. None. In fact, we'll forever remain indebted to you. Are you serious? <laughs> Just maintain the peace and be good girls, okay? Thank you, Nai. Thank you, Nai. Thank you so much. Okay. Oh, you 
me if they actually told you all of that. Eh? Yes, they did. Mm. And because of that, now you want to deviate from our original plan. No, Chief. It's not as if I'm deviating. Mm. I'm just confused here. I don't know what to do. <laughs> you don't know what to do. Yes, Chief, I'm scared. Look at me here, trying to eradicate poverty from your family. And you are sitting here telling me you don't know what to do. Hmm? Look, let me shock you. Do you know that this same thing you are running away from, Ngozi and Chinye have agreed to do it for me? Oh, now you are surprised. <laughs> and if they do it, and I become the next Igwe, I will make sure you suffer. Okay. So you go ahead and be brave, be bold. Go ahead and do it. Do it. You don't want to be my lolo. I do. Uh -huh. hmm. Go ahead and do what you're supposed to do to get to that position. Beautiful maids of the palace. Hmm. How are you? We are very fine, sir. And uh, how is the Igwe? The Igwe is fine. We are coming from a message. We went to send someone a message. Hmm. Very good. I'm Olaji. How are you? I'm fine, sir. <laughs> Come. Okay, sir. Have you forgotten that I was the one who convinced the Lord to? Make you the chief cook of the palace. But we won't forget that, sir. So why is it difficult for you to do what I asked you to do? Sir, what you're asking of me is too much. Olachi, well, you know that without me you would have been banished from this kingdom. Yes, I do. And I'm very sorry, sir. This is not a sorry issue. Just do what I asked you to do. Don't you want to marry a rich man? You don't want to live happily? I do. You want to be a cook forever? Mm -hmm. Hey, um, you know when is she coming back from her trip? Oh, this evening, sir. This weekend, sir. This evening or this weekend? This weekend, sir. This weekend? Yes, sir. Okay. Thank you, sir. Mm -hmm. Okay. All right, you. Okay. <laughs> you really didn't know how to do this. You're sweet. Very sweet. I'm sure. I'm sure. I think you're even more stronger. Yes, I see your age. <laughs> You know how to handle a woman in bed? Are you sure? Huh? No, I can't just leave it. Any woman who comes to your bed will come crawling back into you. <laughs> see, see. Don't forget to add that thing when you are cooking on. Not when the food is ready. When you are cooking, you add it to their food. And I don't know how to achieve that. Hmm. That thing is for both of them. Oh, really? Hmm? Let them go. Do you know that if I'm able to eliminate them, I will become the next Igwe. And when I become the next Igwe, you will be my lord. You <laughs> see, <laughs> you already have the body of a lord. Are you sure? Oh, I sure. <laughs> I swear that. Uh, okay. Just do what I ask you to do. You will never regret it. I will, Chief. But you know what? You are not from the royal family. So how can you do that? How can you make me your lord? How can you even become the way? Do what I asked you to do. Leave the rest to me. Huh? Have you ever heard of 
Money answered all things. Have you heard that saying before? Oh, oh, leave the rest to me. Do what I ask you to do. Okay, I'll do it. Okay. Consider it done. Okay. I need your carpet. <laughs> <laughs> Discovered hey. oil on the land. Hey. What are you talking about? Igwe, Igwe, my brother's land. I killed him because of the land. It was the devil. It was the devil. It was the devil. I didn't know what I was doing. I didn't know what I was doing. Oh, I killed my brother. What is happening here? Okay, why are you crying? Uh, why are you crying? Why is he crying? We lost his wife and the baby. Uh, what? How? He didn't complete the money for his wife's cesarean, so we lost her and the baby. Oh no, no, no! But I just brought the balance. Why didn't the doctor start with the money he came with? Huh? I just broke the balance. Hi! This is unfair. This is unfair. Uh, uh, uh. Hey, you? Please come. Uh, please, come and take this girl on and get some more water at home. The one here has finished. Okay, <laughs> and uh, please, uh, also tell your mom to give the palm wine kappa the 400 naira that is on the television. It is meant for the wine I bought for my brother, Okafo. Okay, okay. 400 naira? Yes. It's on the television set. I'll be right back. Okay. Uh, yes, okay. Where are you now? In the farm. With who? 
Okay, you sent Juliet to get something from the house. Okay, I will join you soon because something came up. Ah, brother. <laughs> oh, careful. Ah. <laughs> this one you came to the farm today. Uh -huh. I hope all is well. Brother, all is well. Though. But you know, those goats I bought for my project supervisors, the ones they will slaughter for them when they come for inspection. Okay. I'm told that they have to eat grass so they don't die. So I have come myself to get grass. Okay. <laughs> so I have come to cut grasses that they can eat. I see. Yeah. Uh, but uh, I, I am seeing a rope instead of a cutlass. <laughs> yeah, but, uh, are we going to cut grasses with two cutlasses? Because I knew you were here and you had your cutlass. Okay, okay, <laughs> and this rope okay. is to tidy grass when we cut them. Ah. <laughs> and uh, those grasses that are good for goats, yes. they, where are they around here or in there? Uh, no, we can actually find them. There's, uh, oh. there's a nice <laughs> Okay, brother, well, please help me. This rope is to tie the grasses. Uh, <laughs> okay. I was actually watching for Okay. okay. Uh, hey, Julia, uh, you sent her home to uh, get some uh, water. water, water uh, yeah, no problem, no problem. By the time we finish cutting the grass, Okay, she would have been back. Okay, let's, let's go. Deserve to live. Exactly. You deserve to die. My <laughs> people, I don't have this for you. Uh, for you, I will talk. I'm a bad man. I'm evil, and I will confess my evil. Uh, please, just forgive me, my people. I am evil. I am wicked. I am bad. 
I will confess my evil. Oh, uh, even the youth leader who came to my house the day Juliet came to my house, I was the one who invited him. Uh -huh. um, youth leader, how are you? You know who is speaking, right? Oh yes, Chief Okafo. Oh, so how are you again? Mm -hmm. Um, you know that bro uh, my brother's wife and daughter who were banished. The daughter is back in my house. She sneaked back into my house. So I want you and your boys to come in as early as possible and take her away. Why are you asking such a... Hold on. What question are you... Why are you asking me about such a question? Are you telling me you don't know the consequences of such an action? Do you want the entire community to be wiped off? You don't know? Oh, good. So you will come in the morning as early as possible with your boys and take her away. And don't go telling everyone that I called you. So I'm just trying to protect you and to protect me and the entire community. Okay, so you will come early in the morning and take her away. No problem. That's why we made you the community leader, the youth leader, huh? Okay? <laughs> we will continue to support you. Everybody forgive me. Why? It was the devil, oh. It was the devil, oh. Mm. Hey. You, you. No, 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 no. What's going on? Leave me alone, leave me alone. Leave me alone, leave me alone. 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 Leave me this man is evil. He doesn't deserve to be alive. This man is evil. He doesn't deserve to live. Oh, look at him. Look at him. Don't just smile. Don't have to take laws into your hands. Moreover, he's still your father. He can never be my father. He is not my father. And he will never be my father. Any mother is as heartless as he is. He will never be someone's father. I'm heartless. Uh, I, I also made Alice lose her sight. <laughs> oh my god! Uncle! Uncle, why? Uncle! 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 Mama, mama. Mama, 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 how do you make me and my mom go through these pains? Why? Why, Uncle? You're so wicked. You're wicked, Uncle. You're wicked. What did we do? <laughs> Just tell me what did we do? Hey. Look out for me. You're an evil man. We don't need somebody like you in our kingdom. Yes, yes. He's weak. I deserve to die. Where I am evil. I'm bad. Yeah, I will not do it again. I will not do it again. Oh, it was anger and jealousy. Please forgive me. Forgive me. Forgive me.
Cry or mourn him. He is a disgrace and a cost to our community. I have spoken. next tomorrow for your all Mary coronation and reconciliation feast. Uh, but I said I don't want to be part of any ritual, sacrifice or initiation whatsoever. But pastor, must she be part of it? I understand how both of you feel about this whole thing. But I can assure you it has nothing to do with rituals or idol worship. Ola Mary? Yes, actually I will be the officiating minister that day. Pastor, are you serious? Yes. Oh my god, that's nice. Juliet. They have all embraced Christ. And everything is under control. I talked to God in prayers about it. And he is in total control now. Hi. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. The Lord is good. Sorry, right. time. Pastor, I'm so happy. These trouble are over. God, just look at Mama. She can see again. Uh, I now see better than before. <laughs> X-ray eyes, pee pee pee. <laughs> so I think we have to go to church for Thanksgiving because everything is just brown new again. <laughs> okay, let us pray. Let us pray. Uh, okay. Jesus name. Amen. Mama, you know this. My dad's new came around. He came to take stock of his property. I told him to just let everything be at this moment because you know I'm still in shock. No. I just want to get involved in that thing. Chief Benson, how did you find us? How did you trace our house? Well, my only son wants to commit suicide because I have not allowed him to marry your daughter. He's at home trying to commit suicide. Anyway, what I have come to do is to send the seat, your hand, and your cooperation to my son to marry your daughter. So, what do you want us to do? Well, I'm giving my approval now and I'm ready to sponsor the marriage even today. I've come to take her with me. The decision is yours to make. Come and save my son's life. You have to go and save Johnson, well, okay? <laughs> this is interesting. Oh, yeah. Chief Benson of all people. Kneeling down and begging you people to help him. Not us. He was only begging Juliet. Okay? Oh, God. God, he was shivering. He was almost crying. Can you imagine <laughs> Chief Benson? <laughs> God. <laughs> Do you know, if I told you girls, I'm not the happiest person on this earth. I will lie to you girls. Mm -hmm. Like, I wish I was there. I, was, I wish I was there to see everything myself. <laughs> Don't you get? So, um, the wedding should be in two weeks? Yes, yes, yes. Uh, um, two weeks, you know? <laughs> Chief Benson wanted it this weekend. Yes. But, you know, Johnson and my sister said no. So, it's two weeks then. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that should be you. Me too. Don't tell you, my girl. Me too. Uh, <laughs> my day. Huh? Uh, this is a... Huh? Twelve now. I shall be snapped. Wait, wait. I think say now. Now be the phone. My sister. Not be the sister. Now me. Oh. Oh. Let me do it. Don't call my name. Let me try. Let me. Hey. Now see. Because I want to achieve. Oh my God. Wow. 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 Um. I'm going for shopping Monday. Mm -hmm. Yes. Um. No. I need to get something classy. You know I need to look good. Yeah. yeah. Okay. yeah. Me too. <laughs> me too. You know. Yeah. yeah. You know, I'm just so happy for my sister. 